All right, so we have Babunga versus Oscar Glez. Babunga uh, repping that, that fish boonjin and Jenny Fox being played by Oscar Glez. So we're going to uh, Pepper Pain first round, which I feel favors fish boonjin in this matchup because it makes it a lot easier for him to get early kills using that up B. And with the recent side B nerfs, it's gonna be harder for him to secure mid to higher percentages until very high percentages with side B. So uh, it's gonna be an interesting set, but we're right into the damage. A quick early damage lead coming out for Babunga, going for a very early up B, but it's just getting equalized. There's axes coming out and another up B comes out and that's gonna take the stock. That's exactly what I'm talking about. F tilt, up B, it's gonna clear things really well. So we're going to be having to watch uh, some really careful spacing by Oscar in order to prevent that from to it just needs to not happen anymore. Down tilt to cover the get up. It will do some damage and down B does come through. Down B much less safe now. It has armor instead of invincibility. It also has 10 less active frames, so it's much easier to punish, which most people are pretty happy about. Oh, the down the down air flex and he quickly goes for that side B to try to get that mobility or just to put Jenny into a rough situation. Side B comes out and it's not good. Oh, it does get the kill. 78%. Three stocks to one right now. Babunga wisely not going for a down air, avoiding that axe and goes for a back air spacing instead. And we're going to be seeing a boomerang to chip. It's going to be down tilt and F tilt does whiff. I'm kind of surprised that it whiffed actually. And we're going to be seeing the down the down strong and it does get some damage. 62% on Oscar Glez right now. Up air will connect. He does need one more in order to kill and it does get the kill. Next we're going to be seeing boomerang play. It's going to be F tilt up B. Oh, the down, the down B will stop that up B. So we're going to be going for some more neutral play. He's going to get the slap side B. Side B won't kill right now because of better DI, but the air strong will kill. And we're going to be seeing game one going to Babunga. And look who updated the overlay. This guy did. All right, so now we are going to be looking at stages. So Babunga probably going to ban out Noel, and then it's probably going to end up on Ruins. Uh, if he goes Summit, then Babunga is in a much better position because he can navigate around Axes much easier. Palace is horrible in this matchup, in my opinion. Hurtland would be actually pretty good in the matchup, but I don't think most players know how to really do that match play that way and meadow is just abysmal for jenny it just feels really bad so i'm really expecting to see ruins or null let's see if i am right or if i'm wrong Voting stage. Babunga getting those quick early stocks though. Side B not killing, putting him back a little bit, but he's still able to show dominance in that neutral game and get those up B's where it matters. And then Oscar Glez unfortunately getting that suicide air strong, falling for the juice. You don't drink the juice. You just don't drink it. I'm sorry, Kree, but you don't drink that juice. We're gonna be going to Summit. Okay. So that's an interesting decision. Uh, Oscar Glez opting to have more space to try to out navigate Fish's axes. Um, I think Fish win is better here than uh, Jenny is. While she can camp a bit harder, I think that Fish's mobility and recovery is much stronger here than, than Jenny's, especially with the recent wall jump nerfs where you can't just stall at the bottom of the map anymore. And that's going to be an air strong and it's going to be putting Jenny into a really rough spot and the air strong comes out again, but it's, unfortunately it's not going to be covering. And down tilt, up air, uh, up tilt, and we got the first F tilt. He's going to call out that down B and get the F tilt follow up and it's going to be great. Really good damage, really good stock, and only 8% against him right now. Babunga getting that quick uh, flex side B for another 16%. You could probably do a little bit more damage, but man, that move always looks nice. Oh, he could have gone for more and that's going to be a kill. Second down strong comes through really well. And we're going to be seeing F-Tilt to break the side, the boomerang and then some extra damage. 32%. Oh, good, uh, good down throw to Axe. 
and the flex breaks the boomerang and we're going to be seeing some more pressure coming out from Babunga going for that side B down Eric does come out F tilt on the wrong side getting broken up by that down B back air combination and we're going to be seeing an air dodge this should be an easy follow up up B and may take the stock no it does not Summit does have a much higher higher ceiling but Babunga quickly cleaning up this set taking it 2-0